Sharon Newman is in deep trouble, and her world is about to be turned upside down. While she tried her best to cover up a shocking incident at Daniel Romilotti Jr.'s penthouse, there's a good chance her secret won't stay buried for long. With Cameron Kirsten breathing down her neck, Sharon took extreme measures to clean up what could be a fatal mess. But did she really think she'd get away with it? Make sure you stay with us until the end as we unravel the chaos brewing for Sharon. It all started when Sharon felt the pressure mounting from Cameron, and she knew she had to act fast. She found herself in a grim situation involving Heather Stevens and took matters into her own hands. Although she's not certain she's directly responsible for Heather's demise, Sharon knew that if she didn't act quickly, she'd be the prime suspect. With her fate hanging in the balance, she carefully wrapped Heather's body, wiped away the blood trail, and did her best to remove the corpse from Daniel's penthouse without leaving a trace. But did Sharon truly think she could get away with something so risky? In a tense and nerve-wracking moment, Sharon carried Heather's lifeless body through the door, down the hallway, and even took her down the staircase before loading her into her vehicle. She was careful, but was she careful enough? As viewers watched Sharon's every move, it was clear just how exposed she was during the entire ordeal. So, is it possible that Sharon's actions were captured on camera? Think about it. The building where this all took place isn't just any run-of-the-mill location. This is the very place where billionaire Devin Hamilton Winters once lived, a high-end property with all the bells and whistles you'd expect from such a lavish place. It's hard to imagine that a place like this wouldn't have any kind of security measures, right? That raises the question. Could surveillance footage exist that shows Sharon in the act of removing Heather's body? And if so, could it come back to haunt her? Sooner or later, someone's bound to investigate. Whether it's the cops or even Daniel himself, someone will start asking questions and the truth might start to unravel. Sharon might feel like she's bought herself some time by throwing everyone off the scent. But we all know it's only a matter of time before the pieces start falling apart. The police are bound to dig deeper into Heather's sudden disappearance, and all eyes might turn to Sharon when they start piecing things together. Imagine Sharon having to face the harsh reality of explaining why she was spotted carrying what looked like a body from Daniel's penthouse, dragging it down the stairwell, and loading it into her car. It's not just about being caught on camera, it's the story that footage would tell and the forensic evidence that could back it up. If the police start looking into it, they'll undoubtedly discover Heather's blood was there, even if Sharon thought she had wiped it all away. No matter how thorough Sharon thought she was, there's bound to be some proof left behind that could seal her fate. So could Sharon Newman's entire world be about to crumble? The walls are definitely closing in, and it's just a matter of time before everything comes crashing down. Will Sharon be able to wiggle her way out of this mess, or is she destined to face the consequences of her actions? Let us know your thoughts in the comments, and don't forget to subscribe for more updates on the chaos that's brewing for Sharon Newman. Hit that notification bell so you're always in the loop on the latest twists and turns in Geno City.